If you've been wondering if it's possible for Nintendo's Kirby to get any cuter, I can tell you without a doubt, he can. Hey guys, Jeff from TTPM here with Kirby and the Rainbow Curse from Nintendo. Kirby is the little pink puffball from Planet Popstar. He likes to transform into different things, and in the Rainbow Curse, he is reimagined as a ball of clay. Kirby rolls and dashes through a colorful clay world, and players control where he goes by drawing a rainbow rope for him to travel along. You draw the rainbow rope on the screen of the Wii U's gamepad, and the idea is to place them strategically so you can get Kirby through the level while avoiding obstacles and finding the large number of hidden items. Figuring out how to get Kirby to a specific spot in a level using the ropes is a creative and fun game experience that Kirby fans are going to love. The game is rated E for everyone, and we think kids as young as six should be able to play it on their own. You don't have to have played previous Kirby games to enjoy this one, but Kirby fans of all ages, including adults, are probably going to like it the most. While this is basically a single player game, up to three additional players can join in using Wii Remote Controllers, and control characters that assist the main player. If you have a Kirby, King DDD, or Meta Knight Amiibo figures, those figures will activate different powers for Kirby in the game. Each figure can only be used once a day though. Like most platformer games, once a level is cleared, there really isn't any reason to return to it. However, levels in this game are loaded with hidden items and areas that completionists will want to replay until they have found everything. Kirby and the Rainbow Curse is available now for Nintendo Wii U, so check it out. And for more reviews, including more video games, subscribe to our YouTube channel and check us out at TTPM, where you can also find the best online prices and availability.